good morning and welcome back to my channel um it's friday here today is the kids last um actually i'll leave that on their last um like weekday of their march break so we're just heading out here we're actually late but i just wanted to um, say good morning to you guys we're heading to the play mcdonald's the kids have been off for their march break um all week and today's friday so today's like their last weekday and then they just have you know kind of a regular weekend so we're heading to the play mcdonald's to play the kids love it there we're gonna meet my mom and she's gonna come with us and then we're actually gonna go and do some thrifting we're gonna go to the second hand store um back to value village i haven't been to value village in in, I can't even remember when it's been probably been a few years I don't tend to go there often um, but we're gonna go there today and see if we can find any goodies um, so we're all ready to go the kids are actually in the van so um, I just thought I would take you guys along so come and spend the day with us it's supposed to be pretty mild here today I'm gonna take my jacket just in case all right I think I have everything this is a little close up because I'm trying to uh, hold everything in my arms the kids are outside I think they have everything I'm gonna leave my jacket home. Okay, so we're all ready to go. Is everybody? Do you guys have a good March break? Yeah. yeah. Did you, Emily? Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna head um, head out. But look at this. I've been showing you guys the snow. Well, we're getting there. Look at how much grass we can see. Oh. We're going in this way. <laughs> Keep going. All right, we're all done at the play McDonald's. The kids had some lunch. How was your time at McDonald's? We're off to Value Village now. See what goodies we can find. That you got a Christmas. It was like a dream for kids. I'm on this side. I'm right here. Oh. Will that fit you? You can try it on. Let's go. All right, last stop. The kids have a few dollars that they want to spend. A few dollars left on their gift cards. Thank you, Jacob. Okay, let's go. See what's in this dollar store. In you go. Do you have enough for all that? Look at the what? Skittles. Skittles? Oh, yummy. This is the helicopter that Audrey got at Value Village. I have to record this here because she's going to Nanny's and she wants to take her helicopter with her. But that was a pretty good find. Audrey was pretty excited about that. She's anxious to um, take it and play with it with her Barbies, aren't you? Okay, you can take it. These guys are leaving me. <laughs> well, that was a jam-packed day. We just got home. It's almost four o'clock. I didn't think that we would um, be gone that long, but that was a fun day. Uh, we went to the Play McDonald's. The kids played um, there for a while, and then um, they had lunch there. Then we went off to Value Village and I think the kids really enjoyed that just looking at all the different toys and all the different um, all the different things that were there. Jacob was amazed that that there was just so much stuff. Um, so that was fun. You never know what you're going to find at the second hand store. Um, and then we went to the dollar store um, again. I've been to the dollar store three times over this March break. 
um, but the kids had um, some gift cards and um, they wanted to use up the last little bit of their gift cards today and buy some treats um, so they did that some treats and some toys um, so I'm going to get started on supper here. I'm going to make some chicken legs for supper, but I just wanted to show you what I um, found at the secondhand store. So we found um, a few good deals. Audrey found that Barbie um, helicopter. The kids are all gone to mom's. The three older ones, they all wanted to go um, to mom's to play for a bit. So they're all there. Audrey wanted to take her um, Barbie helicopter with her. So she took that, but that was a great find. She was pretty excited about that. She loves her Barbies. Um, Jacob found this um, nice Under Armour sweater. So that was a good deal. He loves Under Armour, um, Under Armour clothing and um, he loves hoodies. So he was pretty excited to find that. Um, that was... $3.49 so that wasn't too bad of a price a nice cozy sweater I'll get that washed up for him I found this nice a spring coat for Ben this nice North Face jacket I thought this was really nice it was in great shape you know I'll get it washed up and there's no rips or stains so that'll be great for Ben um, for the spring that was only a $6.99 so that was a good deal and um, it's a size 10 12 so it fits him perfect so that was a nice find um, Emily, I picked her up some Barbies. I wish they had I had clothes on, but that's what I got for Audrey, $1.99 for those two Barbies. I found these nice cozy pajamas for Ben. I thought these were so cute with the bears on them. I love bears. These were only um, $2.99, I believe. So I will get those washed. They're, um, they're really nice and soft. They're like that, um, that snug, they're the snug fit. Um, I don't know what the material is, but I thought they would be just really cozy for Ben. He doesn't really need pajamas, but I thought for $2.99, he could maybe get rid of another pair and have those, but they're just nice and soft. And then um, Audrey saw um, this Barbie. I didn't open it yet, open it up yet, but she's one of those, um, I think they're called like I Move Barbies. So like her, okay, her feet don't move, but... Um, she bends at the knees and she bends at the wrist and I believe she bends yeah, at the elbow. Um, so we didn't open her up, but Audrey, Audrey will like her. She's been wanting one of those I move Barbies. I think that's what they're called. So that was everything that we got at Goodwill and then Audrey's helicopter. And then at the dollar store, I got this here, um, a salad dressing shaker. I've been wanting to make my own um, salad dressing. So I thought when I do, that would be a good little um, jar to keep it in. I got this little jar for my sourdough. Um, for those of you wondering, my sourdough is not going great. I can't seem to um, get it to rise. Um, so I'm kind of um, having a bit of a hard time with that, but I will, um, I'll try again. Um, I picked up some of these um, dishwasher tabs in the dollar store. There's eight in each bag. So I picked up three bags of those. I picked up this little basket um, for $2 in the dollar store for um, paper. I thought I could put my printer paper in it. It just sits in the closet and the bag that the paper came in is all ripped in that. So I thought this would just kind of keep it contained. And then Ben and Audrey, they combined their gift cards and they picked out a bag of Zesty Doritos and a two, um, two pack of Mars bars. So they were gonna share all that. And then Jacob, um, he bought three of these bars. Actually, I was really proud of Jacob because there was um, a man out at the front of the store asking for, I'm not sure if he was homeless or um, or not, but anyway, he was out, out at the store, you know, asking for stuff and Jacob um, decided that he would give him one of his bars. So I just thought that that was um, really thoughtful and really kind of him. Um, so Jacob bought three of those. He ate one and gave one away. He picked out some Jolly Rancher candy and, oh, he picked out another little crocodile toy. And um, so that was the kids' gift cards. Emily had a bag of cheesies. Um, that was what she picked for her treat, but she ate hers on the drive home. But those were all of our, um, our Goodwill and dollar store finds today. So now I have to get started on supper. I have some chicken legs that I took out a couple of days ago for supper. Um, there's a chicken leg recipe that I've been wanting to try. So I'm gonna get started on that. Before I get started on supper, I wanted to show you guys my nail color today. Um, the sponsor of today's video is Madam Glam. I've worked with Madam Glam in the past and I've been really enjoying their nail polish. They have so many different shades, um, so many pretty colors. I really like the way this nail polish goes on. It's, um, I really like the glossy, smooth finish. All of their nail polishes are gel polishes. The color that I'm using today is this Autumn Aura. 
and they give the true color on the top um, of the uh, on the top of the lid there. So that's what color I'm wearing today. I also picked this nice pinky color. It's called I Amore. It's kind of like an orangey, an orangey pink. And then this other nice um, pretty pink shade. I thought Audrey might like this one as well. And this one is called Bubble Troubles. These are from Madame Glam's latest collection. They're uh, color of the year 2024 collection. So those are the colors that I chose. So Madam Glam is offering my subscribers a 35% off discount on your order. So I will leave the um, link in the description box below, but you can use the code Lindsay35 if you want to save 35% off on your order. Um, the link will take you directly to their website and the coupon code will activate automatically. And if you don't want to become a VIP member, you can just click the pay as you go option. So I hope you guys will check them out. I've been really happy um, with their nail polish and um, I think you guys will like it too. For supper, I am making um, it's crispy baked chicken drumsticks. It's a recipe uh, from Pinterest. Um, it's getting late to even be um, getting this started, but anyway, these chicken thighs have been sitting in my fridge. Um, so we're gonna make them anyway. A quarter of a cup of flour, half a teaspoon of paprika, quarter of a teaspoon of oregano, quarter of a teaspoon of garlic powder, some dried basil, This basil is old, so I'm not sure how um, good it even is. Some black pepper. A half a teaspoon of salt. Give that a mix. I'm not sure if this is even going to be enough to coat all of my um, drumsticks or not. Well, I just realized that I did this wrong. Um, I was supposed to just have the flour um, by itself and I was supposed to use breadcrumbs and mix the breadcrumbs and the spices. So I think I'm just going to add some breadcrumbs in here. I'm using panko crumbs. I think I'm just going to mix this all together. And, um, and do it that way. The recipe says to melt six tablespoons of butter and um, then put it in your dish. I'm just gonna throw this in my dish here and I'm just gonna put this in the oven and let it melt in there rather than dirtying another dish. All right, well, I had my chicken legs. I um, took all the skin off of mine. I did not enjoy that process. Um, I have my egg and just a little bit of milk here in that dish. And then I have my flour and my breadcrumbs. You're supposed to dip it in flour, then in the egg, then in your breadcrumbs and um, your seasonings. But I'm just going to do egg mixture and, um, and this. So my butter's pretty well melted there. I'm going to take that out. I'm going to coat my chicken and then I'm going to kind of um, roll it around in the butter a little bit and get this in the oven because it's 4.53 and um, it's getting late. All right, well, this is how our chicken's looking. It's not um, looking as good as it could. I just threw another little blob of butter in there because um, see if that helps because they don't have um, much coating on them and I'm just ready to get this chicken in the oven now. Um, if I had of, I should have done, put them in flour and then in the egg and then in the panko and flour mixture. But anyway, I just want to get this chicken done. So it is what it is, but that's how it's looking. Let's get it in the oven. It says to bake them for 25 minutes and then flip and bake for another 25. All right, well, while that's baking, I'm going to run downstairs and put my clothes in the dryer. 
I started a load of laundry before we left this morning, so I want to get that put in the dryer. So our chicken is almost done. I'm just getting ready to do up some mashed potatoes. So my potatoes are done. I drain them. I just have some butter in there and some salt and a little bit of milk. So this is how our supper is looking. Our mashed potatoes, I put some sour cream in there. I'm just going to um, get that mix mixed in. I have a lot of sour cream in the fridge, so I thought I would add that in there, but I can't mix it with one hand. We're having peas with butter and some salt. And this is how our chicken is looking. So it's looking pretty good. I put it under the broiler um, just for a minute or so just to kind of crisp it up. But that is how our supper is looking. Sorry for the shadows. It's just Dave and me and Emily for supper tonight. Well, I just picked up Ben and Audrey. Did you guys have a fun time at Nanny's? Yeah. Did you have fun with your helicopter? Yeah. yeah. I figured you would play and have fun with it. So Ben and Audrey are going to come home with me. Jacob is going to stay the night at my mom's. Um, our chicken was good. I'm, I'm not sure if I would um, make that recipe again or not, but it was pretty good. It probably would have been better if I had to follow the recipe um, the way you're supposed to. Um, anyway, I'm going to get these guys home. It's um, 20 after 7. The evenings are so deceiving now with the time change. It's um, I forget how late it is. Emily is home in the tub, or actually she might be in bed now. Dave, Dave is home with her. So we're going to head home. These guys are probably going to uh, play and um, have some of their treats or maybe you guys are going to save your treats for tomorrow. Um, their March break is winding down. We're just back into a regular weekend now, but it's been, um, it's a, it's been a fun week. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. yeah. Lots of fun. That's good. Lots of fun. That's good. That was the goal. So anyway, if you guys want to um, check out Madam Glam, I will leave the link in the description box below. And remember that you can save 35% with the code Lindsay35. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, coming along and spending some time with me. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.